President Biden will end the COVID-19 national emergencies in May. Nearly three years after the coronavirus pandemic started, normalcy for the most part is back. The public health emergency allowed the government to give free COVID-19 tests, treatments and vaccines. But once it ends, many people may have to pay out of pocket for some of those items. The White House will turn a new page with plans to end the national and public health emergencies on May 11th. Mr. President, if you know it's the right thing to do, don't wait until May. Let's open our country back up again. COVID isn't over. Uh, we've been very clear about that. The administration opposed abrupt termination, arguing it could create uncertainty for the health care system. They also say letting the emergency expire immediately would bring chaos to the border because it would lift Title 42, which allows the government to expel migrants at the border, citing COVID-19 concerns. As for student loan forgiveness, the White House says ending the national emergency won't change the legal justification of the plan. Officials say many borrowers still face the risk of default because of COVID-19.